Greetings, Scotty Reed here of Black Talk Radio News and, of course, New Abolitionist Radio. If you missed our broadcast last night uh, covering day two of the national prison strikes in the United States against 13th Amendment authorized prison slavery, please check out that podcast. But I wanted to come at you and let you know what was on tap for tonight on BTR News on the Black Talk Radio Network at 6 o'clock p.m. Eastern. We'll have um, a frequent guest, Brother Kwabana Rasuli of Clear the Airways Project. He'll be coming on so that we can discuss this Supreme Court decision that says that um, rap music that's targeting police officers is not protected speech saying that sort of uh, targeted violence or promotion of targeted violence against police officers, a.k.a. slave catchers in the system of slavery practicing racism, is not protected speech. Now, of course, we know if you um, follow the work of Brother Kwabana, um, of the work that he does through Clear the Airways Project, it's, it's perfectly fine, though, for these FCC licensed radio stations to promote violence against black people by black people or any other kind of violent behavior uh, towards other black people. That's perfectly protected speech and you know people will even stand up for the rights of rappers to promote violence in their own communities or in the black community and what have you. So we'll, we'll be taking a look at that. That's a First Amendment speech issue. I've also been talking about these free speech absolutists who think that you should be able to say whatever, whenever, and wherever you want to say it against whomever. So check us out tonight. Also, um, new developments in the Trump administration in terms of his criminal misdeeds being uncovered, coming to light. You got some of the people closest to him who are flipping on him, and he's freaking out. Uh, you even had prominent, uh, I think he's Trump's personal attorney now, replacing uh, Cohen, who just flipped on him uh, against to the FBI about his illegal campaign uh, contribution or financial dealings. But you got Rudy Giuliani out there uh, actually calling on Trump supporters to react violently against the U.S. Uh, government, to rebel against the U.S. government is Trump, if Trump is impeached, which I don't think will ever happen, not as long as Republicans control, um, like Donald Trump said, he could stand in the middle of Times Square and shoot somebody, and people with his followers would still support him, and of course, you know, Rudy Giuliani probably would defend him and what have you, so we'll take a look at that and more news tonight on Black Talk Radio News with yours truly, Scotty Reed. Uh, broadcasting real grassroots radio from the Dirty South here in North Carolina. By the way, continue to support the North Carolina-based nonprofit Black Talk Media Project, which uh, manages Black Talk Radio Network and our social media platform, btrcommunity.com. Um, if you got a problem with Facebook or any of these other platforms, then come to btrcommunity.com. $24 a year subscription that helps us uh, maintain our independence and maintain our media platform. So again, check us out tonight, BTR News, 6 o'clock p.m. Eastern Time on BlackTalkRadioNetwork.com.